ready today uh, in Ipe, where the start is from the fifth stage. Uh, we're gonna have some cobbles today, and uh, I think the team is looking forward to it. My, uh, me and myself, uh, I'm not too happy with the, with the rain, but uh, we will see what we can do and uh, hope, uh, hope for the best. The much-anticipated fifth stage of the 101st Tour de France would see already nervous riders wake up to wet conditions as they had to tackle the cobbles for the first time since 2010. The conditions would not hold back Belkin's Lars Boom, though, as he made a solo break in the final kilometres to take the victory. Yeah, well, um, uh, we were really well prepared, we were really motivated. Uh, we have the, the best materials, the best tyres, uh, very motivated team, dedicated team. Uh, we had already the goal in the winter. Uh, we worked uh, to it uh, as a team and uh, all the coaches, all the mechanics, everyone. And, uh, amazing job. We will celebrate it uh, really big, absolutely. Uh, the feeling was awesome all day. Uh, really good legs. Uh, Always a good position on the bike and on the couples, I think. And yeah, it was really special for me to uh, to ride uh, this stage in the rain and with this kind of weather. It's uh, it's yeah, it's perfect for me. With one test over and the champagne not quite flat, there are still further tests at hand to worry about as the race heads up into the mountains. Um, yeah, I'm feeling pretty good. Uh, I'm glad we we uh, go into the to the hills now and. Uh, for me, it's better to uh, the, the peloton is less nervous than uh, than it was before. Um, yeah, now uh, now really the tour starts, and uh, I think uh, Lawrence and Bauke are really well, and I think uh, they can show themselves today. With conditions not improving, the riders faced yet another brutal day in the saddle, and hope of keeping the team's GC contention alive. With the riders back in one piece, it is time to evaluate the day and the team's overall condition. Well, it was not easy. Uh, Bauke and Laurens really had to fight uh, for it. But uh, I think we are satisfied. Uh, Bauke finished 11 today, 9 in the GC. Yesterday he was not feeling very well, so uh, well, we are happy that, uh, that he's getting better. And uh, hopefully, at, uh, he progresses like he does now and then uh, hopefully in the Alps uh, he can move up a little bit more. Follow the InCycle Twitter feed to see how Belkin's hopes continue throughout the tour.